hello everyone welcome back to my channel so guys uh, today's demonstration we will see how you can uh, install the trading network and mws installation in software ag 10.x okay so guys i already uploaded uh, the video on the basis like how you can download the free download version from browser 10.15 and uh, also how you can install the integration server designer adapter and universal messaging so once you done with the integration server and designer part uh, installation part then you can start the trading network and mws installation okay so let's start the demonstration so very first i required a, a software ag installer so let me open the software ag installer so give me one minute please okay so just click on the software ag installer click on yes and now in front of you you can see the uh, software ag installer here okay so once this page will open then click on the advanced option and click on the images option here so here you can see the uh, use installation image icon is there so you need to select this checkbox again you can see here the two ways are there create image and the second way install from image so if i already downloaded the zip file so i'll select this option if you don't have the image then you can go with the create image option okay so i have a image then i'll browse it from the particular location so just check it where it saved so here you can see web 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 free download 10 15 64 bit zip file so select it select and uh, here you can also validate the image so once your validation done then click on a ok button okay then you can click on next option so here uh, extracting the information from the products and once it get done then you can see this page so here you can select your installation directory and start menu group name okay so software ag uh, this is uh, by default name but it's already in use so i just change it by test one yeah test two okay and here also i'll update the start menu group as a test two okay now click on next option uh, so guys uh, for this mws and trading network installation on your local machine first you need to complete uh, the installation of integration server and designer once you done with then you can install the uh, trading network and uh, mws why it is must so i uh, will see later i'll explain in details give me a moment so we need to install the trading network in mws so here you can see the my web method user interface so here you can select the trading network ui and integration server ui and monitoring for a monitor ui okay and here now you can see in integration server here you can see the trading network server 10.11 okay and if you want to end to end monitoring option then you can just maximize and you can select but we don't have api gateway and uh, also integration server or this packages we don't have so you you can ignore it no problem so those element you require you can select it and if you want to install letter those element you can skip this part and then click on next so here as i selected the trading network server and trading network ui as well as my web, my web method user interface integration server ui 10.11 and monitoring ui 10.11 so once it loading so it's finished okay here you can see those elements you selected you can see here okay so as i i don't want the universal messaging right now so you can unselect this particular option and then click on next 
here you can uh, mention the password as a manage confirm password as a manage here the checkbox is uh, available if you want to change this password after the first time login then you can select the checkbox if you don't want continue the same password then you can uncheck this box okay then click on next here guys see here integration server license file will be required okay if you select like if you upload the integration server license file here and if you log in your mws page after that you won't able to see the b2b related files or b2b related options in mws so for that purpose if you're installing the mws and trading network so make sure that in integration server license file we need to install the trading network server license file only so let me show you in integrations uh, free trial license file i already downloaded and here you can see the trading network server 100.xml file you need to select it if you instead of trading network you if you selected the integration server file then what happened you are able to log in the AMWS, no problem, but uh, over there you can not able to see the B2B option. Okay, so just select the trading network license file here. Select. Now here you can see instance name. If you want to keep the same port and everything same, then you can. I already use this port, so I just change it by double five five seven secure port double five four five and diagnostic port double nine nine three okay and again uh, if you want to keep this option in your uh, services like if, if you want to start the server restart the server stop the server by using the services option then you can must select this checkbox okay once it done then click on uh, next here there are two ways uh, file like if you have database then go with external rdbms and if you don't have then go with embedded database but guys you are like you are installing the mws and trading network not a universal messaging if you are installing universal messaging database you not selected no problem but here we require a database so here you need to follow the external rdbms option now maybe you have oracle sql server yeah my sql yeah postgres server any server you can select it so on my local machine i uh, like have a sql server so i just select this particular option now here you can copy this url and paste it here and here you can change the details so server my server name is localhost port I know it's a one four double three database name it's an employee I already created now you need to mention the connection name so I'll take it as a connection database user as a essay and password as a I'll mention it okay now it's done then click on uh, next here you can see the trading network database connection so i it's already selected sql server connection name url as well database user and password so these things already done here is a platform manager option no need to change anything you can keep it as the same here common directory service support here you can see your database details now i already like updated all the details here so i just copy and now you can paste here connection name as a connection and uh, database user as a Yes, and I'll mention as a password. Now here you can see the my web method server. 
there are two option new installation and second one is a side by side installation for upgrade so now we are doing a fresh installation so i'll just select this option new installation here you can see the instance name default and port is a 8585 okay so this port we required when you log in the or like when you open the admin page okay so very first you log in this url like localhost colon 855 so you need to uh, remember this port number and again in services if you want this option then you need to select this checkbox and it will keep by default details sql server details url and database user password so these things also already done here yes, see port 8585 is in use on this machine so i just change it okay i'll go back and here i'll change the port number 8586 to avoid any interruption okay so instance name default port 8586 i'll also uh, click this checkbox database details is already in capture so i'll just click on next here you can see the products those products you selected the list you can see here just scroll up scroll down and check all the elements as well as you can check the updates and if access is there you can click on this particular option you can check and once you click on the install option installation will done it will take some time once your installation done then you can log in uh, like go to browser and uh, open the like enter the url http colon double slash localhost colon 8585 okay so once you log in the mws page or their administrator monitoring option is there and very first you can uh, like change your password so those session will take in next upcoming session so see you in next session guys and uh, so that's all about demonstration and guys uh, if you are new in my channel and if you like this video then please subscribe to my channel you can also share with your friends and if you have any query any concern and please do let me know in comment section we'll see you in next demonstration where you i'll teach you how you can um, like uh, create a trading network partner profiles and all everything we'll see in details so till the time Stay happy, stay connected and thank you so much.